entering the query store, um, the query store, which is a new feature in SQL Server 2016, and the query store is nothing but it's a handy tool that you can analyze the statement with the different execution plans. And so that execution plan you can generate and analyze the different reports also. So basically the query store is nothing but in earlier versions we used to apply the DMVs and we pull the cached execution plan. And here the query store which works a similar way but it will show you the graphical user interface to analyze the data with the different execution plans and also another important thing you can force that the previous execution plan if that current execution plan is doesn't work properly say let's example your query is executing perfectly fine into the one week back and suddenly the your query is changed so then you can go and look into that query store and you can research the execution plan and then just select and right click and force the execution plan so it will show you that execution plan is going to be forced into that so automatically whenever the sql server execute again it will apply and use that uh, force plan so that is the another advantage and key information for that so the major scenarios major useful for the query store is to you can implement and apply the fixed uh, plans it's same like your plan gate but here it's a handy tool you can analyze that uh, num different number of queries and different execution plans and on the memory or cpu or you can apply the query historical plan and then you can uh, force that plan uh, immediately so that is the major advantage for the query store and I'm explaining another topic here same thing in the parallel which is a live query statistics so uh, in earlier whenever the query is executing we used to capture the uh, profiler or we used to look into that plan which was already stored uh, in the cache but now in SQL Server 2016 you can manage the live query statistics so i'm going to show you the demonstration with the particular query and during the execution of that query itself you can see the live query plan so the major advantage is you don't have to wait until and you don't have to depend on the earlier execution plan so you can directly implement and analyze that with the live query execution plan. So this is the new cool future in 2016 and you don't have to wait for the previous query plan.